Hey guys, we are back, we are fixing the generator, and my name is Miss Scarlet Tanager, and we are playing some Rule of Rose. Now since that done, hopefully, since that is done, rather, hopefully we should be able to go all the way back to the other room, since it's working now, and the elevator should come back down, hopefully, by the time I get back there. And we can actually do what we meant to do. Which is what I tried to do way in the beginning of this chapter, which was use the elevator, el 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 elevator, go to the highest point, the highest, the top floor, go back up that ladder, and go say hi to Amanda. Because she is all the way over there. But y'all don't really want to see me just walk to and back, right? And you don't got a lot of things to commentate on, so... And here we are, guys. We are back at the elevator, just like I said we would be. Not a nice little cut there. We're going to go to the upper level, and hopefully I can actually use the ladder this time, instead of trying to get to it prematurely like I did before in the last episode. I'm smart. Sometimes. Okay, rarely. I'm not the smartest person here, but you guys got to give me some credit. I just know the game too well. Okay, let's go up here. You, you be good puppy. You be good puppy, Brown. Who is not Huey? <sighs> this game got loud all of a sudden. <sighs> That's not the top of an airship. <sighs> you okay there, Amanda? You. You're doing okay. You do you're doing all right. Are you gonna go Lord of the Flies on me now? Is this gonna be a boss fight? It's not, but still. I did not need to see that. about me putting a rat in your face? I kind of had to. Oh, Jennifer. You know what? What? Something special. Look, isn't he cute? Why do you have it and why is it all fucked it's up? It's yours. Give it as a gift and you'll be Miss Popular again. Why did she take it to begin with? Man, I, t I take it back. Hoffman's not creepy. This lady's creepy. <laughs> yeah. She's being a stuffed doll of me. And I passed out again. That's probably the worst situation to pass out on, because she she probably could have just turned around with that stick and just beat the ever-loving bejeebus out of me with it. And bye, Joshua. Did I fall down the ladder? How did I not break something doing that? Shrug. Shrug. <laughs> well, I guess we gotta go, uh... Talk to the red crayon aristocrats about the doll. Come on, Brown. You thought you would have protected your master a little bit better and beaten their bits and bit the testicles off of Joshua. Why did I say that? What is with my commentary today? It's so weird. Is it just me or is my commentary weird today? Just. just Brown can go full attack dog on anybody who gets near me. Or just sit there and bark like Brown usually does as I'm getting molested by creatures that just envelop my torso every time they attack me. I'm not even really attacking, they just jump on your torso and start hugging you to death. It's a deadly hug. It's the best kind of hug. Well, that wasn't nice. Okay, so I go the other way? I get- oh wait. Before I get ahead of myself. Go find the bear! Go 
go find the mayor. Did I go the wrong direction again? I probably did. I usually do. I totally did. Okay. So I guess the bear got taken into the middle section. I gotta be wrong every now and then, I guess. <sighs> Yay! Oh, hi, Joshua. You you wanna you wanna bring that back here, please? How am I not able to run faster than this kid? Also, why am I not calling out to him? Just going, hey, hey, you! Give me back the bear! I'm going to get a rotten rat shoved in my face again. Scott the bear. Scott the bear. Just give me the bear. You're finally here, Jennifer. Do you want the bear back? I'm sorry, but I'm rather fond of it. Too bad it's missing and all. Well then, take care. <laughs> God damn it, bear. God damn it, Joshua. Oh, this is gonna end poorly. Great! Great, because this is why we can't have nice- I should have saved. I should have saved! I didn't save. I- I didn't save. I- oh, fuck. Okay. Boom. Boom. Get her- Yes! Gotta kill him! Gotta kill him! Gotta kill him! Gotta kill him! Okay, there's one of them. There's two. And three. Booyah! Go. Find the puppy. Or, not find the puppy, find the, the... The doll. Not the puppy. We're not looking for a puppy, we're finding a doll. How many health items do I have? One, two, three, four. That's good enough, right? <laughs> I say that, you know I'm gonna get killed in the next one, and I'm gonna have to do the next 20 some odd minutes since I last saved all over again. Where are we going, dog? DOG? Puppykins? Poopy puppy? Puppy puppy? Puppy puppy poop? Why do I go faster than the dog? You think that we would go about the same? About the same speed? Nope. I go faster than my dog, so I have to keep stopping and waiting for the dog to catch up. There we go this way. Brown. <laughs> what the hell, Mutt? Okay, fine, I'll go this way. Central stairway C. C. As in your swimming. The sea. It's funny. <laughs> My jokes are really weird today. And again, I never even make jokes. I just make observations about a game that I already really well know. If you guys hadn't noticed yet, we're not even really on an airship anymore. It's all it's all an anagram. Not anagram. A um metaphor? Yes, it's all a metaphor. Joshua, get your I'm gonna step in there and then I'm gonna get attacked. Yep. Great. Get off me! Off! 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 Off the fog! Okay. Ow, I itched my nose and it hurt. Don't itch your noses. It hurts. That didn't help. You're not supposed to have weapons! Illegal! Ow. Uh oh, bad, bad, bad! Use the lollipop. Nom 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 nom. Don't hurt me! No! 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 Ow. You see why this is going to end poorly for me? Wait, I can't eat those? Oh. I'm gonna die, 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 I'm gonna die! I'm gonna die. I'm gonna die. Okay. Okay, I got this. I got this. I got this! Just gotta kill this one! Just gotta kill him! Just gotta kill him! Okay! Okay! Okay!
I'm gonna be right back. I know I'm going to my death here. I could not find any healing items. I know I'm going to die here. I know it's going to happen. I know it's going to happen. And there it goes. I knew I was going to die there. That was the last one, too. There's only three of those fights. Only three of them. How bad is it? How bad is it? Um. Oh. Be right back, guys. Good! There! That only took me, like, I don't know, is, according to the time thing, about 45 minutes! Which, of course, was partially my fault, but hey, I'm not dying! And I've got a kitchen knife. Because one of these guys had a kitchen knife. You know, it makes me wonder why I can't take the weapons from the other dudes, like, the brooms, that stuff. Hopefully, we're at the end of this. Because I'm really hungry, and I meant to finish this. Like, okay, just so you guys know, I've been recording for pretty much exactly two hours, right? Okay. So, I've been recording for two hours. But, each one of these episodes is only 20-ish minutes. That means... Okay, so I gotta go this way. That means that I have been recording... An extra, let's see, four episodes at a time. That's about an hour and 20 minutes. I've been recording 40 minutes extra between the last four videos. And almost all of it was in this one. Great. Okay, we gotta go up here. Is it time for another cutscene where Amanda tries to get a little too friendly with us and then stab us in the face? But, okay, I gotta go to the lower level then. Fine. I'll go to the lower level if you want me to go to the lower level. I just want to find this kid so I can shiv him in the butt. Just stab him in the butt. With my chopsticks. I'm gonna stab him in the butt with my chopsticks. And then I'll take the bear back. And then we can become one of the aristocrats of the Red Rose. Which is exactly what we want, correct? Probably not, actually. Okay, where are we going, pupkins? Pups. Pupsicle. Poppycle. Second passenger hallway. So this is just going to take us on a really long runaround that takes us right back to the gift box. Is that what happens? It's been a while. That that might be what happens. That <laughs> this looks like what's gonna happen. We just went on the world's biggest loop. We went to go find Amanda, and the generator broke, so we had to fix that. So we had to go to the other side of the airship. Yep, that's exactly what's happening right now. Okay then. Then we had to go. Oh, back up and go see Amanda, and she was obliterating an effigy of us, which is not very nice. Don't do that to your friends. It's not nice. Then we had to go follow the scent of the puppy, the doll, after we got the doll because we passed out and the doll got stolen from us. Bear. The bear. The stuffed bear. So then we had to ta track down the bear again after it got taken by Joshua going upstairs into the main area, middle area of the airship, going all the way to the other side of the airship, coming back down again. And now we're just going to end up all the way at the aristocrat's box, aren't we? I'm willing to bet. I'm willing to bet, I don't know, my chopsticks, that that's where we're headed. 
Because that's what it looks like we're headed. If he turns left, if, if, if the puppy turns left, the puppy turned left. If the puppy turns left again, the puppy turned left again. Okay. This game, man! I love it, I love it to death, but every now and then, every now and then, you just get that one part that's rageful. I thought the rage part was going to be during the mermaid boss fight, but no, I forgot about this little bit here. Those three fights where they force you to fight things that are really, really hard to hit with this terrible, terrible combat control scheme. <sighs> Rule of Rose, you are trying my patience. Oh, I found Joshua. Great, he's missing his tail. Just get Amanda on that. After you punish her for having stolen it in the first place, but... Hi. I got the bear. I got the bear. His tail got torn off. We can probably get Amanda to fix it. Just a couple stitches here and there. He's like, oh no, it's bear. Oh no, he's Joshua. Let's use Joshua. Oh. Oh, right, I have to make an offering. Uh, make an offering. Of Joshua the Burr. I found him! Are you gonna let me be an aristocrat now? Or are you gonna torture me some more? You're gonna torture me some more, aren't you? You're always torturing me. Hi! Well, this is going to end well. Come here, Jennifer. I don't wanna! Let's have a little talk. I don't wanna talk to you! I don't wanna talk to you! I don't wanna talk to you! <laughs> Hi, Amanda! How'd you get back here so fast? You lying douchebag! Hi, Diana. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to the Aristocrat Club. A word from the princess. Jennifer has brought a wonderful gift to the Aristocrat Club. It's tight to Now you can have your very own red crayon. Yay! I'm gonna have a crayon! Hats off to you. <laughs> Yay! I'm gonna be an aristocrat! Amanda's such a lying jerk. I don't want to take my hat off. Oh wait, my hat's over on the bookshelf. Never mind, I'm not wearing my hat right now. It's not reverse now! Usually when they say the bright red crayon just for you, it's reversed. But not in this cutscene. Hi! I don't want it! You can keep your red crayons! You can keep them! I don't want them! Nope! <laughs> yes, like, I don't want your red crayon! They've all got red crayons in their hands, by the way. I don't want it! sketchy at all. No. Not in any way, shape, or form. Great. Would I like to save? Um, yes. That's probably a good idea. Especially since we're getting towards the end of this video, but I think I'll finish the intro cutscene to the next chapter first. Might as well. November 1930, the funeral. I think this 
this is the last chapter, actually. I think the funeral is the last chapter, not including the optional one. Optional. We're back into the orphanage. And now I'm covered in crayon drawings. That's not nice. Does that say sea? As in the ocean? And my mouth is just all the red crayons. That was not very nice. I found your bear, and you tortured me for it, and you wrote on me, and you made me eat wax. Just, just jerks? Just made of jerks here. Brown help! Brown help! Brown help! Brown help! Go! Brown help! Stay! Brown help! Go! Brown help! Brown help, please! Brown help, please! Brown! Go! Dude! Go! Come! Or do I have to say come? Brown! Come! There we go! Now he gets up now. Help me out! Help me out of here, please! Thank you, puppy cans! So yeah, we're back in what's supposed to be the filth room. And our poor dress is covered in red crayon drawings. Somebody had some fun with this, I'd say! The unlucky girl realized this was the old mansion. Unfortunately for her, despite the beautiful sunset, this was the unluckiest of days. Only the girl's silent companion saw her as she suffered in fear. And so, this day began. And there's a red crayon. A bright red crayon, just for us. Anyway, that's gonna be about it for this video, guys. My name is Mascara Tanager, and I am playing some Little Rose. I'll see you all in the next video.